Hello, um, I'm going to do a Blender tip on how to clean up seams on your textures. And here we have a rot texture, and you can see that there are seams over here. And um, what you can do is use a cloning tool to texture paint over that. So, to get started, you have to select the object, go into edit mode, and make sure the right texture is selected. Otherwise, you'll be editing some other texture. Once you do that, go to texture paint mode, click the T for your tool, and select clone mode. And if there's no texture here, you can create a new one, and um, cloud texture works for cloning. This doesn't need to be anything. I don't know if it does that, if it does anything at all. Um, but so you control click, control left click, and start pasting over. And it just cleans it up. How you handle your textures is up to you. Um, it's good to not just take one spot and go all everything, you know, just make sure it looks like it blends. And, uh, that's pretty much it. Once you finish texture painting, you go over to this window and click Alt-S, and it'll save your texture and then after that you can make a new normal map for that because these textures change and you'll end up with seams just a tiny bit of seams just because you're applying a different normal map than the texture so that's that hope you guys enjoyed that I had lots of fun and uh, yeah, let me know if you need anything else, any tutorial. That's it.